There we go, boys and girls. There is my homemade replacement escape hatch lid made from angle aluminum. So right now it's just taped into position, but I will be putting on corner pieces and riveting, caulking, everything together with some uh, Marine uh, 5200 adhesive. And uh, it will be very, very strong and permanent. So the opening is uh, 22, or actually 21 and 7 eighths. And I made the unit 22 and 3 eighths. And so it fits just nicely right over everything and fits over and around snugly on the um, um, weather seal that's in there. And the weather seal, it's kind of like a, a rubber hollow tube that compresses. And I think I'm going to get a new one because this one is old and it's kind of gnarly looking now. Uh, anyway, um, mission successful. And then, as kind of a bonus here, I'm pretty sure that you can see the old original curly hinge in there. There you see the old curl hinge. And I'm pretty sure that I can make a curl that will go from this and uh, get in there. So I think uh, I think I'm going to be okay with the um, original old style elixir hinge, is what they call it. Okay, so there you go. The mother of invention and a couple of tools equals. New and improved, okay? And by the way, there is Dome Rock and my sunset. Okay, hope you are enjoying it. And I will have the finished result of this for you tomorrow. And then to just hold this in place, I've got a couple of bungee cords. That will... Uh, Hold that down, keep it from popping out. And I've got about five days before any weather is predicted, so I should be good to go, okay? All right, I will see you on the next video. Okay, so this is the inside view. So it's working very nicely. You see it's see-through. The blue film is on it yet, and uh, so I need to get up there in the morning and take it out before the sun hits it for too long because it will uh, permanently attach to the plexiglass if I don't. So I got a lot of lot of work on that thing to do yet tomorrow, getting uh, uh, the inside pieces fitted. I'm doing a second layer that'll get uh, sealed in there with uh, Sigaflex and. Uh, so we'll see if uh, my impromptu insulated window will be uh, moisture condensation free or not. I don't really care though. So, okay, let's, uh, well, I'm going to uh, just pack up and uh, do whatever I need to tonight. Okay, see you later. Okay, so I will show you in a uh, upcoming video shortly about how to make that roof vent, and uh, I'm very pleased with it. It's uh, coming together better than I expected, and um, as dumb luck would have it, a couple of things actually worked out for the better, and I will show you what those are. They involve the hinge. Uh, I'm not 100% sure that it's going to work out for the better yet, but we shall see. All right, I will see you on the next video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment if you uh, are interested. All right, bye-bye.